hey hi everyone welcome back to the channel today i'm doing apo i'm going to show you guys a place called apo and uh, i want to show you what the kind of structures that are found in apo and uh, also talk about apo resettlement so that you guys can understand the difference because someone asked me on the comment section saying that they have something in apo resettlement is it different because the structure you seeing there is not as beautiful as the ones i've been showing but i want to just show the person what can be found in that area all right i hope you guys will enjoy this video here we go We're actually in Apo right now, okay? Uh, if it, what The thing is that, let's look at this structure so you can see there's one on my right hand side. That's an estate. Uh, and you can see the kind of structure that you can find there, you know? Some people think that uh, because they've seen some kind of videos or pictures of Apo resettlement, they think the whole place is those kind of structures. Apo, Apo resettlement is actually a place where the government built to resettle the locals, you know, people who were moved from their original place and the government built those structures so that those guys can move there. So that is why it is, it, it is called Apo Resettlement. But in spite of that, the other section of Apo, people buy land and they build whatever structure they want to build. Fantastic structures are actually existing in this part of this city. Uh, my duty today is to show you, what I'm planning to do today is to show you the Apo Resettlement area and what is found there and then the other section where people have built fantastic structures okay here we go i know apple uh the road leading to uh where we're going to right now the resettlement area is pretty tight uh you can see they're actually dualizing it i i hope if i hope you can zoom up front there so that you can see they're clearing uh spaces there you can see they're actually dualizing this road it comes all the way from um and Nyanya from all the way from that area through uh, AYA straight up is supposed to go down all the way down and another road coming from uh, uh, what's it called Karshi is supposed to cut across it that goes all the way to um, uh, what's it called towards uh, Sunnyvale and all that area okay so because of that this the this road eventually when they are done is going to be a fantastic wide road i'm telling you okay i want you guys to see to my left you can see some structures in front there fantastic high roof structures wow this is apple so uh anybody that gets a prop a property or a land in this area you can build it it's it just that the resettlement area uh, when the government build them they build them because uh, like low cost houses for people they reset the villagers they reset to so you wouldn't expect the government to build this kind of structure structures for them so uh let's just go let me show you the resettlement area and then we we'll talk from there you know i really want to keep driving or not say anything to get there but just that you can also see to my right you can see structures look people are building it doesn't have to be a small thing like maybe you have seen okay let guys let's just get to the resettlement area let me show you the kind of houses they find there then you can see compared to this one you have seen here Alright guys, uh, we'll be entering um, Apo proper now on my left hand, on my left side here. Somewhere in front of me is uh, the first shop right in this city, but uh, we're not going to talk about that now because I'm not sure we're going to go in that direction. But let's go here so that let me show you uh, Apo. Okay. Here we're just entering Apo. This is the major road that, excuse me, guys. <clears throat> this is the major road that goes into Apo resettlement. Uh, on my right, there's a filling station. We just passed it. We keep going. There are a lot of malls, a lot of shopping malls, uh, 
the road here is good they have some structure you see you can even see some hills i did a video some time back about a place called the uh, uh, is it acropolis okay i can't remember the name is that the bed i'll put the link you guys can see what that place looks like it's right here in in, in, apple, in apple so uh a lot of structures on my left hand side and there are some on my right let's go down to the next turn when i take the next right turn so that i can drive into the area and show you the kind of houses that are uh that we can find in the uh, apple resettlement okay we're gonna go right this time and uh, show you you can see the houses to my right uh, we're taking this turn here all right the roads you have to drive be careful you can see the houses are not high rise they are just normal houses they are not fantastic the government build these houses to resettle people they've displaced from where they are staying but here's what happened a lot of these houses were now being sold off a lot of people who bought these houses decided who government gave these houses to decided to sell off their houses some of them kept their houses the one of the things they did was this for those that kept some of their houses what they did was that they got they got tenants and then they will make the tenant, they'll tell tenant if you can build maybe like a self-contained or a two-bedroom or a one-bedroom somewhere in, within the space that is available there. When they squeeze in those houses, they will now come to an agreement with the, the tenant that has built it. Okay, this is what it costs you to build the house and your rent is say 100,000 for example. They will now divide by the number, the amount that was used to build. They will come to maybe a couple of years, maybe five years, ten years, whatever it is. Then you now agree with the person that owns the property to live in that house for that amount of time and when that time is due you can start paying rent or when you want to leave you can leave then the man will the house will now belong to the owner of that land so that's what happened you can see some of this to my that's what most of these houses they did they started building small small structures and renting them out apart from the houses the government built for them so I just want to drive through this place so that you see what a poor resettlement actually looks like. These are the houses that government built. You can see one this way properly. You can see it. Yes, that's the kind of house government built. But some people started like rebuilding them. Some, like I said, uh, gave the land to some people to build so that they have more uh, tenants in their compound. You know, that's a poor resettlement for you. I'm just going to drive down this lane so that you guys can see the houses in Apple resettlement. When I'm done, I'm going to drive to another section of Apple to show you what other people who bought the, their land decided to start building without, uh, you know, because what happened is that a lot of these people who buy this land, they build them to their taste because this is what they want. And it is not restricted or streamlined like the way you have in a uh, estate where every structure must go with the same design. Here, no. You build whatever you want to build. You're, you take it to the area council or whatever department that is responsible for approving uh, the structure you're going to build. Once it is approved, they make sure you follow it and you build these houses. Okay? So, uh, we're coming out somewhere on this same road that same road that we branched off is just in front of us here we're going to just join it and i want to drive through so you can see like in front of me there you can see a lot of houses by the hillside i want to drive let me go right oh no let me see let's go right let's go right let me see if we can find a way into that area so that i can show you the houses that people who bought their lands decided to build this is same apple you understand but like i said those houses are the resettlement houses but these other ones are the ones people just buy and they decide to build for those that got the resettlement houses i'm sure most of them don't have the finances they will have actually maybe demolished it and rebuilt fantastic houses but no they just have to keep managed because they're actually not very rich so we're just going to keep driving on this road i'm going to find let me see if i can find uh, any road on my to my left or so let's drive in so that i can just go around and show you the kind of houses you will find in this area and i'm telling you it's going to surprise you the houses you will find there are houses everywhere in this area but i just want to show you you can see like to the to the right where we're to the left where we're turning there's a mall there's one also after it you can see one one with the red paint and white is it gray paint but you can see this one now this is what we where we just entered and 
I want to drive along so that I probably stay behind this truck so that I won't be speeding so that you guys can see what we can find here. There's a structure going on here. I don't know what it is, but it's big, it's massive. Oh, okay. Let's take this right turn. I don't know. Let's just take this right turn. Let me see what we can find on this section. You can see the houses here are not like those those ones we saw. All right. So we just entered the area now. So I want to show you guys the kind of houses you find in this place. Look at this structure. Beautiful. <laughs> I'll look at the one to my right also. Like a twin duplex or something. It's fantastic. Wow. Let's just drive down. I don't know where this road will take us to. I don't know what we'll find, but let's just drive. If we can't find, if we can't find a way, we'll, find, we'll always find a way, really. We'll always find a way. So, guys, you can see Apple is not uh, what people actually think it is. Because when you, once people hear of Apple resettlement, they just think of those run-down houses, houses that are not really well... Uh, uh, built and all that that's what they think apple resettlement is but actually it's not like that okay i don't know where this road leads to but let's just take it that's how we roll anyway we're always trying to figure out places and we just drive and show you guys what we'll find or what we'll see just the way you're seeing i think i should keep the camera straight so that you guys can see because turning the side to side sometimes uh makes you lose some section we're not really seeing it well let me go right let me go right and uh, we we'll just drive a bit. If there is no way there, I'll turn around and we'll come back and go the same way we came in. This part of this section is not tired. I think I'll make a U-turn here because I'm seeing that place is not too tired. Let me make a U-turn here. But I'm sure by the time the government comes to fix up the place, it will be more beautiful than this. Let's go down. I don't know where the road leads, but let's go down. I think I see some some place start there in front. Let's just go. So let me show you guys what we can find in front there. I have no idea what this street is called. I'm just driving through to show you the structures. Wow, look at this one. Just keep it straight so that you can see, see this massive one in front of us. Yeah, you can show it. Just keep it there so that we can see these other ones in front too. Guys, bear with us. <laughs> I'm just showing you the beautiful structures that you find in Apo. Fantastic. You know, it's it's amazing that you know somebody like I always keep like I say most time that somebody might be living in an area he would think his place is the most beautiful place. But I tell you the truth, there are other places that are beautiful. You never get to know because you don't go out to find out. So you never really get to see these places. But the moment you drive out and you keep driving, you will see that people are building. Structures are coming up everywhere, you know. Let me just go straight. I don't know. Road 4 to my right. Wow, look at the structure in front of us. Beautiful. All the houses here are, are fine. They are pretty fine. I mean, you know, you. I, I know in my head sometimes, I'm, I personally I'm thinking, oh, well, let's just drive because I can see. Oh, I've gone that way to show the houses towards the hill that way. Let me see if there's another turn into the left. We might just take it. Let's see if we can find houses that are built in that section. Okay. Guys, I hope you guys are enjoying this drive through. Look at this structure. Whoop. <laughs> let's go this way. Let's just see. For this fun of not knowing where we're driving to, let's just drive and see. <laughs> well, cars are going down this way. Let's follow. Let's see where it takes us to. There we go. Guys, I hope you guys are enjoying this video. Uh, like, okay, if you're new to this channel, this is the first time you're seeing my videos, please do subscribe to my channel. I will really appreciate that. I will really, really appreciate that. Wow.
Look at houses in that place. This is nice. <laughs> okay, I think this is almost like the road we passed just now, but it's not for security reasons. Maybe you drop it a bit. Let's drive this way so that I can show you what we can find here. Wow. Guys, are you seeing this? This is beautiful Apple. And you know, when people think about Apple, they, like I said before, they used to think, that, oh, it's not a very fine place. But I'm telling you, this place is beautiful. The streets are well made. I'm telling you, well made. Properly tarred. Wow. Guys, I know there are some properties that are not developed yet. You can see empty lands here and there, which is still fine, which means the place is coming up. And that is why the structures you are seeing here are very beautiful because they are more modern structures. They are not like some other places that have been in existence longer than 10, 15 years. But for these ones that are just being built now, they are building modern structures and they are beautiful. They are beautiful. So guys, I hope you're enjoying this. Whoa, gives us a thumb up, thumbs up, a like. <laughs> oh my God, I enjoy doing these videos, guys. I just enjoy showing you places. Oh God, I enjoy it. I hope you guys are enjoying it too. Road it. Wow. Well, I think let's go left. If there's nothing there, we'll just make a U-turn and come back. Uh, okay, I can see the road is... Okay, well, there's a fine structure in front of us. Let's show that. Let's take this turn where this car is taking. We don't know. Since the car is going that direction, let's also go. Look at this house. Beautiful. Let's go this way. Okay, I think we'll have to make a U-turn here. Let's just drive up, show that section then we... Oh, this is the road 4 we saw that time, you remember? Wow. Okay, I think it comes... Because, okay, at that point, it had like water-logged place. That's why we didn't continue. Oh, ah, okay. Okay, let's drive straight. We came from this section, from the right side. But let's drive straight and see the houses that we will find. Whoa, guys. Whoa, guys. See this. It's not been painted, but it's just beautiful. This is nice. Wow. Okay, I know some of you may ask this question. How much is it uh, to rent houses here or to buy? If you have those kind of questions, please make your comment down below. I'll respond to each and everyone that makes that comment or asks that question. If I have a question, I'll be able to respond to that. All right. You know, the truth about driving like this for me is that I'm also discovering these places. That's one. And I've never been there. It's like trying to figure out how the place works <laughs> sometimes we drive and no we don't show them we get to stop and check to find to find our bearings so that we can get out of some some places to drive ourselves into because we don't know the way we just drive okay i see a bike going that way okay ah well let's go Okay, this is road one. I think we should drive out this way. Let's drive out this way. This was where we came in that first time. Remember, the first place we came in. We're driving out now. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I, I, somehow, I, I wish I could show those houses by the side of the hill. If this is a road, let's just drive along the road to see if we can find some houses on that section. The road is not actually tarred. Let's go this way and see. Really, 
I will have just ended the video here, but I just want to go on this on Tad Road and see what we can find here. Let's go and see because I know I saw some houses from afar that are on top of the hill or by the side of the hill. Let me see if I can get close to them and show you guys. Sorry, the roads here are not hard. They are still, uh, the, the structures here are still coming up. So obviously most of the times road like this won't be tarred until they have almost finished buildings. Uh, then they will now tar the roads because if they do, these heavy trucks that carry uh, laterite and all the stuff may actually damage the road. So, uh, okay, let's go left. Let's go left. Okay, we'll just show you a couple of houses in this section and we'll be done. Well, I don't know where that road in front of us leads to, but I think if we go left that way, we might be going out of this area. So let's just get to that section and go left and see whether we can get ourselves out. Look at the houses on top of the hill I wanted to show. They are way up there. I don't know how to get there, but I hope you guys can see it. They are top of the hill there. You can see. Let's zoom, up, zoom out a bit so that you can see how high it is on the hill. Oh, too much. Anyway, guys, I've just showed you some of those houses on top of the hill. Let's see if we can drive out from this section. If we can't see, find a way here. We'll turn around and go back the way we came. I have a feeling that this road will lead, take us out of this area. But if it doesn't, we'll always find our way back. Let's see where this road takes us to. We have no idea. We're just discovering. Let's just go. Well, I think we should go left. Sorry, go right. I think we should go right. Let's go this way. Okay, so guys i hope you enjoyed this video if today is the first time you're watching my video please 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 hit the like button hit the subscribe button so that you get subscribed to this channel and also uh share so that others can watch and also like this video too and if you have been watching my videos and you never if not subscribed to this channel please do subscribe i need the subscription guys all right okay and uh see you guys in the very next one ciao Subscribe, like, share, comment, see the next one.